Hey y'all, Jim here with the next cast. We're gonna get outside, do some fall fishing. And as the temperatures like to cool down, the bite likes to heat up. And the one way you can make this happen is by going ultra light and downsizing your baits. Today, I'm gonna show you how to use the Lunker Hunt wax worm. I got an ultra light setup. We're gonna get out here, get on these fish. I'm gonna show you how it's done. Stay tuned y'all, it's time to become a better angler. Can you guys see that action in the water? That is kind of what they're looking at. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Very nice. Oh yeah. Look at that, y'all. That's what we're out here for. Beautiful. Look at the size of that one. That's a beautiful bluegill right there. Fishing with the microplastics. All right, let's let that beautiful fish go. Hey y'all, if you want to see me fish a specific technique or a certain bait, I try different things. All you have to do is just leave a comment below on what you want that to be or how you want me to fish. And I will definitely come out here and try it. And I'll show you how I fish that bait or my version of that technique that you may be asking to see. I had a viewer ask me to try microplastics on an ultralight setup. And that is what we are doing. Got him. That is a better fish, y'all. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's what we were looking for. We got ourselves a beautiful, look at that. Beautiful, y'all. Look at the size of that bluegill. Absolutely beautiful. Catching it on the Lunker Hunt waxworm. Beautiful. Look at that, the colors of that fish. Let's let that one go. Got another one. Oh, yeah. Another nice fish. Let's see what we got this time. Looks like another beautiful gill. Oh yeah, look at that. Beautiful. Very nice. Thanks for playing, buddy. Go get bigger. Oh yeah, there we go. Guys, catching these fish, these pan fish, on an ultralight setup is just so much fun. Oh yeah, here we go. Another beautiful one. Look at that. Look at that. Yes, sir. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. Wow. So much fun. Yes, sir. All right, y'all. So let's talk about our setup right now. I have the six foot six ACC crappie sticks down to a Fluger Trion SP30 reel. This is two pound test line. Okay, high vis. I'm using a Leland Lure Trout Magnet 164 ounce jig head and the Lunker Hunt Wax Worm. And I'm just fishing that, casting out, counting down. And uh, once I get a bite in a certain depth, I will stay at that depth until I don't get any more bites and I'll either move up or down. There we go. Oh, yeah. There's another nice one. Guys, it's just a very slow retrieve. It's gonna be a nice bluegill. I can tell by the way it's running. Oh yeah, look at the size of that one. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Absolutely beautiful. All right, go get bigger. I'm counting down to about seven. There we go, right on the drop. Got another one. Very nice. Here we go. What do we got this time? Oh, and it got me in the brush. There we go. We got her out of there. All right. Look at it, guys. Absolutely inhaled it. That is the moss. It is all the way down its throat. So, I'd be gentle. Slide our finger in there. Pop that out. That's all you got to do. There we go. Beautiful. Go get bigger. Okay, we've caught a couple of them. And I've had a couple of them swallow it. 
So at this point, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to retie. I'm using a loop knot, and it is an extremely durable knot, y'all. However, if I was to catch a bigger fish, every time I catch a fish, that knot is getting weaker and weaker. So we're going to quickly retie this, and then we'll get back out there and get in the action. Another thing you guys could do is if you are casting out and you're getting nipped at but not getting a complete bite, you can add an enhancer. What I like to do is add these Berkley Power Bait crappie nibbles when I'm throwing most plastics as an enhancer. It's a great scent, and then the color also gives them a, another flash of attractant. Remember, guys, if you're going to be out fishing, you want to increase your odds of catching the fish. So unless you're out there doing some type of personal challenge to become some type of angler who only catches with plastics, and there's nothing wrong with that, always increase your odds of hooking up and getting a bite by adding an enhancer. Got him. There we go. There's another one. Beautiful. Nice hook up there. Let's see what we got. Another beautiful bluegill. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Guys, this microplastic ultralight fishing, if you haven't done it, this is so much fun. These fish fight so hard on this light gear. Got him. Very nice. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yes, sir. What do we got? This one feels like a nice one. Oh, yeah. Look at the size of that one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Absolutely beautiful. Look at that. That's what I am talking about. You always tell it's a bluegill because it's got the black patch right there on its fin. Let's get you off of here. Thank you for playing. It'll get bigger. There he goes. Nice. Oh yeah, that's a better fish. That one does not want to be playing around. What do we got? Big old bluegill. That's what I'm talking about, y'all. Look at that beautiful one. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Absolutely beautiful. got him oh yeah that is a nice one oh yeah where are you going baby where are you going there we go very nice look at that look at that beautiful guys we were having so much fun this is just i wondered at first when people said hey you need to try ultralight fishing you need to try the microplastics i'm like mm, i don't know it's hard it's very hard to beat getting out here and catching these beautiful hard fighting sunfish and I'm waiting to hook into a crappie and feeling how hard they fight on this light gear. Guys, if you haven't tried it, you need to try it. Let's let that one go. Oh, right off the bat. As soon as I threw it in. Yes, sir. Look at that. You're not very big, but guys, they fight so hard. Absolutely slammed it. That is a good looking, healthy, young bluegill. We're gonna get that off the hook. Get it back in the water. Go get bigger. Man, the durability, I've caught probably 20, 25 fish on this so far, and you can't even tell. It's not ripped. It just, the durability of that is very, very, very good very pleased with that if i was going to recommend to anyone that's just going to start like beginner fishing you've never fished or you want to help someone begin fishing get them an ultralight setup get them some microplastics and this is the easiest way to teach someone simple technique i mean you're going to get bit you're going to catch fish it's going to be fun There we go. Right off the bat, as soon as we throw it in, y'all. That is a good fish. Oh, yeah. That is a really nice... Oh, yes, sir. Look at the size of that fish. That is what I'm talking about. Beautiful. 
beautiful, beautiful, beautiful female bluegill. Absolutely beautiful. Wow. Go get bigger. Wow. I mean, absolutely, as soon as it hit the water. And if you look in that direction, you see all the branches over top of the water. So when this bait falls in the water, yeah, I'm putting an enhancer to it, but even if I didn't, I'm pretty certain. And I mean, I would almost, you can't guarantee what fish are going to do, but I would put a lot on the fact that if this would have just fell out of into the water like that, that fish was going to eat it regardless. Wow. Let's see if we can't do that again. There we go. Oh yeah. There's another one. Another nice one. Yes, sir. Look at that. Wow. Oh yeah. Absolutely beautiful look at that fight that's what i'm talking about get up in here wow y'all this is just so much fun i mean i'm telling you look at the size of that bluegill it's as big as my hand absolutely beautiful yes sir pan fishing at its best y'all fall can be so much fun and anyone could get out here and have this kind of fun it does not require any expensive electronics. It doesn't require a boat. And I know people are saying you're at a pond. There are, there are millions of ponds across the United States. And there are a lot of people who will let you fish their pond. So, but you can do this technique on any body of water. Creek, pond, lake. The reason I'm out here on a pond today is we just had Hurricane Helene come through. And the majority of our lakes here in Northeast Tennessee were absolutely decimated. So this is one of the few spots I can actually get out and actually fish. We got a lot going on in some of our uh, waterways right now. Whether it's biohazards from the propane and the gas that have been spilled into them. I mean, there's cars in the lakes. There's boats that have been flipped over. There's houses. So we're out here trying to do a little relaxing pond fishing. And like I said, this technique will work anywhere. You know, there's no magic. I'm not trying to sell anything. I don't work for Lunker Hunt. I don't work for ACC. I'm just out here enjoying fishing. There it is. Oh, yes. Yes, sir. That might be the big one of the day, y'all. Yes, it is. Come here. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Look at that. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Wow. Look at that. That is what I'm talking about. Go get bigger. Got him. Oh yeah. Come here. No, no. Get out. Get out of the brush. Come here. Come here. Oh yeah. That is what we we're waiting for, y'all. That is what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. Absolutely yes sir that's what i'm talking about y'all look at that beast of a bluegill look at that thickness that is a beast that is all natural 100 percent a beast of a bluegill caught on that tiny microplastic ultralight fishing that's what i'm talking about wow Thank you for playing, my goodness. Excuse me, yes. Wow, 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 wow. Man. You're lucky I'm not keeping fish today. You'd be going on a nice sandwich. <laughs> but nope, today you gotta go back and get bigger. Absolutely love it. Wow. Oh yeah, nice, come here. That's what I'm talking about. Yes, sir. Oh yeah, come here. Look at this, oh my God. <laughs> Guys, back to back slabs. That is what I'm talking about. Oh my goodness. All right, y'all, we are gonna end it on that one. Got the ACC crappie sticks, ultralight setup. Got out in just a matter of less than an hour and just absolutely had so much fun. 
I'm going to let this one go, y'all. But remember, get outside, go fish, and have fun. And we'll see you again soon on the next cast. Thank mm -hmm. you.